This is your home television. On it, you've got your premium sports and movie channels, your favorite TV shows, your local news, and if you have a DVR, you have all that stuff recorded. Which is great, unless you're not at home. Isn't it a total bummer that you can't watch that stuff wherever you are? I mean, come on, we can put a man on the moon, clone a sheep, perform liposuction, but we can't watch our TV remotely? Well, don't fret. We have this all taken care of. Hi, I'm Blake Krikorian, CEO of Sling Media, and we designed the Sling Box right here in our offices, just south of San Francisco, California. The Sling Box lets you watch your living room TV and all of its programming, whether you're on your mobile phone, desktop computer, or wireless laptop. Pretty much anywhere. We all love our TV, but more and more we want it on our terms. Now, if you have a DVR, you know what that's all about, the ability to watch when you want to watch your TV. But now, with the Sling Box, whether you have a DVR or not, you're able to watch your living room TV anywhere. For example, in other rooms of your house, on the road, or even at work. The idea for the Sling Box came to us a few years ago. My brother and I are big San Francisco Giants fans, and we were working like crazy. We were either in the office or we were on the road, and we just wanted to watch our team play. So we started looking at different ways we could watch some of our favorite TV programming. And we went on the internet, we checked out different services that were charging us extra or just providing us clips of what we were looking for. And we thought to ourselves, wait a sec, this is a bunch of crap. We're paying $100 a month for our cable bill in our living room. And we were here, here, and here. And we thought to ourselves, man, this is lame. Why the heck can't we just watch the TV programming that we're already paying for, but watch it wherever we happen to be? So we teamed up with video technology guru Bupin Shah and the Slingbox was born. The Slingbox works like this. Simply connect the Slingbox to your TV signal. That could be your cable box, your DVR, satellite receiver, even bunny ears antenna. Then you connect the Slingbox to your home internet connection. Now we're almost done. Download the Sling Player software onto your computer or your mobile phone, and voila! You can watch your TV pretty much anywhere. Now I'd like to show you a few ways that I watch my Slingbox. So here I am babysitting the princesses. They're watching the, the Nutcracker, monopolizing the main TV. So sick of that play. Fortunately, I'm able to sit back here and watch a little basketball via my sling box in the living room. Family time, millennium style. All right, here I am getting a little work done. Now it's time to kick back in the hot tub and watch a little TV. As long as the dog doesn't drink the entire hot tub. Now here's another way I use my sling box. I'm waiting for my girls to get out of their water polo practice and I'm able to catch up on my favorite programming back off my DVR back home thanks to the sling box. Here I'm doing it on my mobile phone and of course I can have full control just like I could from my living room couch. Even if you're not much of a traveler, just using the sling box when you're in your office at work is a great great application. Here I am just watching a little baseball in full screen mode, but of course I can go ahead and just even dock it over on the side in the sling bar mode, which is just terrific for sort of multitasking. When you're trying to work a little bit, here I am on Outlook, but I'm also able to just put the screen over on the side and actually even resize it and my whole desktop resizes. And if you like it over on the right hand side too, no problemo. The point is there's a million ways to use the sling box. Watch a home improvement show in your garage. Watch a cooking show from your kitchen. Watch a show on lions from Africa. Or, let's say you're a member of the UN and they start talking about grain prices in Lower Siberia. South Park, anyone? Or even watch your local news from Paris. Or even in one of those internet connected airplanes. The point is, you can use your sling box anywhere you can get online or get a cell signal. Now, by pretty much anywhere, we do mean within reason. Do not use the sling box while skydiving or scuba diving. The sling box will not work in outer space, at least not yet, or in a fallout shelter, or in a Siberian coal mine. To watch your sling box, all you need is an internet connection for your computer or cell phone connection for your mobile phone. Once you've done that, anything that you can do from your living room couch, you can do anywhere. You can change your channels, and if you have a DVR, you can pull up and watch recorded shows, fast forward, pause, rewind, and even program your DVR remotely. And once you buy the sling box, which is about 200 bucks, there's no additional monthly fees. And why would there be? The sling box is simply giving you access to the content you've already paid for. 
The swing box lets you access the mother of all programming, your home TV. Your sports package, your movie package, your regular cable, even on-demand or recorded shows. Get it all with the sling box. Okay, here are some frequently asked questions. Is the picture quality any good? So I think the video quality is pretty good. One of the most important things here is a set of technology we created called SlingStream. And what that does is give you really smooth video over any network on any device. Much better than your traditional internet video where you see a lot of rebuffering and freeze frames. So can the sling box be watched by more than one person at the same time? Well, the answer is no. And there's really two reasons for that. Number one, we wanted to make sure that we're respecting the rights of copyright holders. And streaming to multiple people at the same time, yeah, that's a no-no. But also, if you really think about it, streaming to multiple people at the same time, you're going to get in a whole lot of conflicts there. People want to change the channel, watch different shows, and so forth. So again, the answer is no. We stream to only one device at a time. Do I have to take the sling box with me? The answer is no. Leave that sucker back home. All you take is yourself and the devices that you normally carry, your mobile phone or your laptop. That's all you need. So what kind of internet connection do you need to have when you're outside your house to be able to access your Slingbox back home? Well, really any broadband internet connection. You can be in a coffee shop with one of those public Wi-Fi networks. You could be in your hotel room. As you know, most hotels now offer broadband connectivity. And of course, if you're on your mobile phone, what we really recommend there is that you have a higher speed data service, typically referred to as 3G. Right now, there's a lot of people who are selling us video clips on mobile phones or other types of clips or streaming over the internet on our PCs, but it's only the Slingbox that gives you full-blown TV. Does the Slingbox support my cable box? Well, the answer is most probably yes. We support over 5,000 different devices, cable boxes, satellite receivers, DVRs. So there's a really good chance that we have support. Another question we get asked quite a bit, does the TV need to be on? The answer, no. Is it hard to use? The answer is no. If you know how to use your remote control at home, you can use the sling box. In fact, in most cases, the remote that shows up on your sling player is the exact same remote you have at home. And chances are, you won't ever have to go digging for it in the couch cushions. Is it easy to set up? Well, mostly yes and a little no. So let me first talk a little bit about how the sling box works. Your TV signal goes into the sling box. Then the sling box takes that video signal and compresses it into some suitably sized digital chunks and then spits it out over the internet. And that's how you can watch your TV wherever you happen to be. Okay, we give you all the cables that you need to set up your sling box. Now step number one, we're gonna take the TV signal from the cable box and plug it into the sling box. Here I just plug the yellow, the white, and the red coming from the cable box into the sling box. Okay, so now step two, we're gonna connect the sling box to the TV. Now, you don't even really need to have a TV for your setup but this is the one that we have to show you today. So step three, we're gonna connect the control cable to the sling box. Now we have two ends of this. One plugs in to the sling box, and the other piece hangs over the front of the cable box. And what that does is actually allow you to change your channels remotely. Okay, TV signals all set up. The last thing here is you're gonna connect your sling box to the internet. What we do is take this network or ethernet cable, plug it on here, now, if you can reach your internet connection, go ahead and just plug it on in. If you can't, we have one more step for you. So if your internet connection is in another room, we have a really cool accessory called the Sling Link. The way the Sling Link works is it lets you connect to your internet connection through any electrical outlet. Simply take your network cable, plug it into the Sling Link, then take the Sling Link and plug it into your electrical outlet. Now, of course, you could also use a wireless game adapter or a wireless Ethernet bridge like one of these instead of the Sling Link, but what we really found is the Sling Links are incredibly easy to set up. Okay, so here we are in my home office. This is where my internet connection is, and we have the second half of the Sling Link. We simply take the Sling Link, we plug it into the outlet, take the other end of the network cable, and plug it into your internet connection. Now, I happen to have a, a router here, so that's what I'm using. Once I've done that, I'm ready to go. My Sling Link has put my Sling Box online. Now, of course, you need to add power as the last and final step for the Sling Box. So simply plug the AC adapter into the back here, 
And once you see two solid green lights, your hardware setup is complete. Now we're almost done. Download the Sling Player software onto your computer or your mobile phone, and voila! You can watch your TV pretty much anywhere. Okay, so we're all set. Here I am on my wireless laptop watching live TV. I can even change the channels, pull up the guide, whatever. So that's the quick and dirty on the Sling Box. Watch your home TV and all of its programming on your laptop or mobile phone. If you have any other questions, I urge you to check out our website, go to the Sling community online, or give us a call. Alternatively, you can contact any one of our retailers. We're available just about everywhere. The Slingbox. Your TV, pretty much anywhere. Thanks for watching.